All right, it's June 18th, 2020, and we're back here at the Royal Poinciana. So as you can see here, um, it's pretty obvious that this, this tree is not doing too well. And I think it's because I've been overwatering it. Um, I don't see too many pest type problems with it. As a matter of fact, I don't see any pest problems with it. The uh, trunk of the plant looks really good, but the foliage here is all coming off. So I've been just kind of watching it here for the past week, um, ever since I stopped watering it, just to make sure it uh, doesn't give off any signs that it does need watering. Um, and I've been wondering if it was gonna bounce back, because as you can see here at the tip, it doesn't look like we're gonna get any more growth. But I just came by today to um, see what's going on with it, how it's doing, and I spotted new growth right here. And I'm super excited about it because that lets me know our Royal Poinciana will be doing just fine here in the near future. I'm gonna to continue to leave it that way and not bother the plant. I'm just gonna let it do its own thing for the next uh, couple of weeks. Uh, no fertilizer, no water, unless it really looks like it does need watering. I'm gonna wait for these little shoots to come out. Here they are right here. And uh, hopefully we can get this guy to bounce back. So. We'll keep watching this guy and we'll be back in the future to see how he does all right so it is july 12th 2020 and it has been just under a month um and we're back here at the royal poinciana and as you can see here he's doing a whole lot better so that little node where we first saw growth is right here this branch right here you can see the scarring right there and we've got more than one branch as a matter of fact we've got this one here going this way and this one coming up on this side you can also see a lot more branches just popping out at the top of this plant here is the top that i was showing you that had died our plant is just uh it's over a year and a half old now and it's been in this pot for some time um, definitely I think maybe maybe it's been in this pot for for about a year um, this is a three gallon pot and that is miracle Grow potting mix it is in you can see the trunk of the Royal Poinciana here is still fairly young and you can tell just by seeing that green color on it because when it starts to mature um, it basically all looks like this and just um, hardens up and you don't really see that green color anymore here's some tiny tiny little sprouts popping up some little branches popping up but i don't think they're going to get anywhere because the canopy up here is already using all that energy to grow upwards so this is pretty exciting i'm really happy this tree bounced back and um this allows me to continue uh the little journey um, we got going with the Royal Poinciana. So hopefully he starts doing a whole lot better here within the next couple of weeks, months, and years. And uh, we will be back to see what he looks like um, here in a couple of months. So far, that's what we got for the Royal Poinciana. We've got some great growth here. This tree is really, really bounced back. And it is so nice to see it looking so healthy. So hopefully we continue um, staying healthy and we'll be back here to see what he looks like in a couple of months.